Lucas can win this. Might be dangerous, Ringo. Remember, they might counterattack, Ringo. I'm up. Yeah, good plan. We're lacking into that. Might be dangerous. No way to tell. <laughs> They're going down. Okay. Ooh, that'll work. Let them have it. Andy. Gotcha. You got it. Right away, Ringo. Like I overlooked that. Out of my way. Ringo, be a bit of a waste to use demons solely for fighting, you know? Oh, you mean they can be used for other things? Yeah, recon. You can send them out to scout our surroundings. And if we get into a fight, you can just call them right back. Oh, then how about we give it a try? Leaving this to you.
new one. Remember, they might counterattack later. Here goes! Too slow! Okay, what now? Let's go. Eat this! I'm up. All right! We're lacking intel on this. They're going down at this power. Eat this! Watch right. yourself, Arrow. Done. I was just getting started. No fault. Too late for regrets now. our next move. What can you do? I'll endure. What next? Let's roll! What's our next move? With this pack, silent as snowfall. Not as a letdown. for small fry. Let's push on through. Right. I know we can win this. Got it. It's all you. Take it away. That should work. Don't know that should silent as snowfall. All according to plan. Fine. I'll get serious. Yeah. 
too late for regrets now. You know the drill. Got it. Take it away. Now, Got it, Ringo. Done. Just what I'd expect. Fine. I'll get serious. Let's stay Stress. cautious. You little. Too late for regrets now. <laughs> I'll kill you. Die. We gotta win this. Uh, Give that a try. Give him hell, Ringo. Ringo. What was that for? Nice moves with this power. That's a hit. Out of my way. Damn it. They're too scared. You know the drill. Try and do Don't the be a hero. Eat this. No way. Not so let down. So both Phantom and Yatagarasu are after this Melody person. But just who the heck is she? It's all you guys talk about. Melody is a devil summoner from the Phantom Society. However, they've marked her as a traitor. And what about you? You must have some reason to protect her, hmm? You gonna tell me? Well, I... Eh, it's fine. I'm sure I'll figure it out sooner or later. Let's keep moving. I know we can win this. This should do it. This ought to turn the tables.
Weapons free. Yeah, good plan. <laughs> What's our opener? With this power. It's all you. Ooh, that'll work. That should freeze you where you stand. We can win this. Out of my way. What next? Fine! I'll get serious. <laughs> Wide open! They're going down. Huh? How's that? <laughs> I was just getting started. Melody! Looks like we need a change of plan. Yo, man! Yo, yo, Arrow's here. Except you ain't no ghost. Or us. Am I tripping, man? My boys told me you were straight up dead. If they cut your mic, stay off the stage, man! I don't know what I was expecting, but it wasn't this clown. Who's he? Yo! They call me Rob Soldier! Ought to be yes! It ain't hyperbole! Cause I could kill on the beat! Representing the Phantom Society! Phantom's gonna need all those covenants. Only way we can rain some hell down on the whole world. We're going live! Your boy RS, he's at the head of the pack. The posers come at me and they don't come back. I drop that face like an earthquake. You throw hands with me, you made your last mistake. Let's go. Here we go. Careful, Ringo. That swagger's not a front. He's tough. They call me all rest cause I'm a dope MC. All my boys making noise in the COMP. So let's make this body count of one, two, three! We can't afford to lose. Fine, I'll get serious. One you know, we're like no thunder. Smart choice. Let me see. Careful. Let's get free. where you stand. Too late for regrets now. Charge. Shoot. We gotta win this. It looks like it'll work. Accessing data. You know. This ought to do it. Stretch. Big damage. Great job, Ringo. Let's go. Take it away. That should work. Silent as snowfall. Too late for regrets now. Skills for the kills, cause they're genuine. 
get what you get when you stop the landmine. Yeah, I'm the payoff, and you're the punchline! Boost the tempo! Check it! We're taking you down. Let's roll! Without a try. No, wait! Thunder! Real! Nice move with this Ooh, power. That'll work. No, wait! Silent as snowfall. Work! Out of my way. So what? Slick skill for a quick kill! Get ill! I'm asking the hope! They're strong. Be on your guard. Uh-huh. Can't be too careful. I won't lose. We'll take them down. I got this. So you. Now go. Too late for the best. Shit! They're strong. All right. Be on your guard. Uh huh. Yeah. You got me. Kidding? I'm spitting gold bars, and your talk is cheaper. I'm the RS, and I don't fear no Reaper. I'm no Reaper, but I can send you to hell. So face the music, RS, and take the L. <laughs> Damn it! He had backup! Ringo! Fig! Ringo, what is this thing? <gasps> it's going into me? The Covenant's joining with you. Covenant? Then, this was the point of Dr. Onda's message. Fig? Fig? Are you alright? Fig! I'm not detecting any abnormalities at the moment. My chest feels a bit hot, though. How strange. <sighs> so, you're a friend then? That's right. I'm Fig. I'm an agent of Ion, just like Ringo. Pleased to meet you, Arrow. Pleased to meet you, Fig. Are there a lot of your kind out there? There are only two like us. Ringo and I have the unique ability to directly intervene with human affairs. Just to confirm, Fig, are we too late to save Melody through normal means? Yes. By the time I arrived, she was already... Yeesh. Two soul hacks this quick, huh? Who'd have thought? Ringo? You can't mean... Are you going to bring Melody back? Like you did with me? Think about it this way. We know Arrow's death is somehow related to the end of the world. Arrow was trying to protect Melody. But what if we assume the trigger is not Arrow's death, but his failure to complete his mission? I can't authorize this. We don't even know if there were any consequences from the last soul hack. It'll be fine. I think I've got the hang of it. That's not the issue here. This is just to be safe. We need to be thorough, and that means cutting this thing off at every turn. And not only that, but I agreed to help Arrow protect Melody. So that's what I'm gonna do. Understood. I'll keep watch. Can I ask you to do the same, Arrow? Uh, right. Protection set to partial. Spell sequence, soul hack. Systems are go.
process complete. This is an unjust world, a false world. Let's destroy it together. so mournful too, just like him. Squeeze of the man in the mask, but you're endable, expendable, so hope you brought a casket. Ooh, zip, talk about a fall. RS has got you, but you're back against the wall. I know the truth. <sighs> A lot easier the second time around. And you are? Relax, lady. You don't have to glare like that. My name's Ringo. I'm an agent of Ion. I'm a super intelligent being born from the Sea of Information, and I'm here to stop the apocalypse. And what does this super intelligent being want with a dead woman? Well, Melody, how about I show you? Just come with me, and we'll go back. I'm dead, you simpleton. There's no going back. Why are you even here, anyway? I'm gonna save the world. That's more than the world deserves. Okay, guess it's gonna take a little more than that. So that's it. This is where you die, and you're okay with that? Because it sounded to me like you had something you still needed to do. You were running away. You wanted to survive. So take my hand, Melody. And you can survive. You'll get one more chance to make things right. She's back! I guess it's true. Ion really is something else.
So Ion is a non-human being born from a bunch of information, and you are like a splinter of it. That much I get. That also explains how I'm back from the dead. What I don't understand is why you're here. Wait, Melody! We're not with Phantom. We're here to protect you. Hmm? What are you talking about? Right, so, uh... I'm actually with Yadagarasu. My being with Phantom was all an act. These two here are helping me with my mission. Yatagarasu? Then you're still my enemy. Only if you're still a summoner for Phantom. They're after you too, aren't they? Doesn't seem like either of us is in the best spot. <sighs> Could you even go back to the Phantom Society at this point, Melody? I think it'd be kind of hard. Tch, what's your point? I'm saying we can help you. And it's not like we're asking you to spill your soul, so why not hear what we have to say? If your only concern is what you'll get out of it, that's fine. Even if you decide to act alone, a little more info couldn't hurt, right? <sighs> I suppose I'll take you up on your offer. For now. Then, it looks like Melody's safe and sound. Sure took a lot of effort, though. Now then, we'll want to go over everything we've learned so far. That should help us get a better understanding of the situation. There's still way too much we don't know. Like about covenants and how you two factor into all of this. For now, we should get out of here. This place is dangerous. But where should we go? If you need a place, I've got a safe house I've been using. We should be free to talk there. <sighs> Thank you, Arrow. Let's hurry then. Really what I expected, but it's not bad. Glad you like it. Fig, Millie, feel free to make yourselves at home too. Thank you for everything, Arrow. <laughs> okay, let's get right into it. Arrow, you were trying to save Millie because of that light form thing, right? Guess there's no point in hiding it now, is there? Yeah, that's right. The Covenant came out of Millie and then went into me. Of course. It's because I died. I get that these Covenant things are important somehow, but I'm only just now starting to wrap my head around it. Can you tell me more about them? You two are Devil Summoners, after all. Hmm. <laughs> Alright. This is my understanding of it. Covenants are like a big source of energy, and they've been passed down from soul to soul for generations. Supposedly, these Covenant holders wield great power. What kind of power? Well, simply put, possessing a Covenant awakens the Holder's latent abilities. In some cases, it can even spark, well, evolution. They say there's a total of five Covenants out there. Having one as powerful as it is, but the effects would only go as far as the individual could take them. Now, if someone were to possess all five, 
and that'd be something else entirely. Gather up all five covenants, and you could... You could what? You could call forth what's known as the Great One, a being prophesied to bring ultimate destruction to the world as we know it. That's what they say, at least. Summoning this Great One is Phantom's top priority. Am I right, Melody? Please. You don't really need me to confirm that, do you, Mr. Double Agent? If the Holder dies, the Covenant gets passed on to someone else. As a result, there's almost always some sort of conflict surrounding them. What a surprise. I see now. So when Melody died, the Covenant found a new owner in Fig. These Covenants, and this world-ending Great One you mentioned. I believe these may be the seeds that make Ion's prediction come true. Gotta be. Considering we're trying to stop the end of the world, the Phantom Society's shaping up to be a pretty big obstacle. Agreed. And now that we know their intentions, we must protect this Covenant inside of me at all costs. That's going to be a problem for me. Forget it, Melody. Our summoning abilities are... changed. We don't have control over our demons. Ringo does. We think it might be due to the soul hack. Excuse me? No one told me about this. Don't look at me. You can still summon through me, however. Do you think you can make do with that? I'd rather you just give me my summoning abilities back along with my covenant. Can you do that? Mm, not right away, no. You owe me for bringing me back to life. Just think of this as a little collateral for the time being. Well, it's not a terribly good deal for me, is it? Way I see it, I'm basically your slave. You don't mince words. I like that. Still, I'm afraid I can't back down that easily. What exactly is the Covenant to you, Melody? I don't think I need to explain why the Phantom Society needs summoners, do I? Right. So you're after the end of the world too, huh? <laughs> hey, Ringo. Mind if I ask you something? Sure. What's up? Ion aren't human, right? So why was the Covenant passed on to Fig? What are you, really? We agents of Ion are highly intelligent beings born from a sea of information. By installing an ego into a simulated human body, the foundation is laid for a soul to develop alongside it. So a machine can have a soul? Is that so strange? Your bodies are practically machines too. Albeit fleshy ones. Even for our kind, there is still a lot about the soul that remains unknown. Like where they come from, or what they truly are. We're no experts either. But the self-evident truth is, should one accurately recreate a human body and provide it with a means of control, then a soul will naturally take root. In other words, it's not just this mechanical shell, or rather, this body at play. It's a complex chain of different physiological reactions that shape the soul. Yeah, I didn't get any of that. Okay, then we're supercomputers trapped inside grandfather clocks. In even plainer terms, our origins may be different, but we are more or less the same as humans. The trade-off is, in this form we can't operate at Ion's full power, nor do we have access to massive amounts of data like we used to. Ah, oh, I see. I guess that's why they said this form was the most ideal for our mission. Can't really soul hack if you don't have a soul yourself, can you? Oh, that's right, Ringo. I meant to tell you earlier, but I've made a new discovery. It's about Target Alpha, Ichiro Onda. If I remember right, that's the famous computer engineer. What about him? Fig was acting separately from me at the time. She was trying to protect Onda just as I was trying to protect you, Arrow. The mission was a failure. But I managed to restore the surveillance camera footage. I found a video of what happened in the 24th Ward Municipal Tower. And? He was killed by someone named Iron Mask. Did you say Iron Mask? The leader of Project C finally makes his move. It was him. So, you know him. Or well, I guess you would, seeing as you two are together. You are? He called himself Iron Mask. Are you absolutely certain? Let's take a look at the footage. Output in video.
Impressive. I can't imagine how many security measures were in your way. You're no mere trespasser. Ichiro Anda, I presume. The greatest computer engineer of our time. It's a pleasure. And you are? I am the leader of Project C. You may call me Iron Mask. <laughs> a bit on the nose. Was Black Suit taken? Or are you a prisoner broken free? Well, it's fine. You're welcome to celebrate with me, Masked Man. So is your little wallflower. <sighs> it's complete. A system to shatter the status quo with a perfect name to shake the very foundation of Akadate. The Omni System. Glorious, isn't it? Can't you feel its power? But now it's finished and I'm done with it. If you're a thief, then go ahead and take it. You've designed a masterpiece, Doctor. The Omni System will uplift mankind to new heights. Alas, I'm afraid your part in our grand pageant ends here. We want something quite different from you. I should have known. If you don't want my creation, then you must be after me. Well, what dwells within me? You want the Covenant. Ah, you're already aware. You do know why the genes. <coughs> Say, masked man, one last tip. Call it. A parting gift from a genius. No one can control the future. Iron Mask. I have a future. Goodbye, Ichiro Anna. Your covenant serves you well, but it will serve me far better. So that's it. Ichiro Ando was a Covenant holder too. And we got a good look at Iron Mask. Plus, whatever that freaky, murdery guy was. The guy that tore out Ando's Covenant, you mean? Strength like that definitely isn't human. Maybe it's some new species of bear or something? Melody, you were on Iron Mask's team. Know anything about that? Not really. All I know is he called that thing Zenin. He also referred to it as a vessel for the Covenants. A vessel for the Covenants, huh? It seems he lacked the power to fend off their attack. Say, Milady, if you and Iron Mask are an item, why is he after you? <laughs> Ringo, what would you say to working together? You help me meet with Iron Mask. What's in it for me? I'll help you prevent this end of the world or whatever you've been going on about. And I'll give you all of the Covenant Holders' names. Deal? You sure? I thought you wanted the world to end. Some things take priority. All right then, Melody. It's a deal. Rather quick to trust, aren't you? Not at all. But we both benefit from this. And for now, 
That's all I need. Speaking of which, I'm hoping we can count you in too, Arrow. Sure. It's not like I don't have stakes in this. All right then. It's settled. Let's all just try to get along from here on out. <sighs> Hmm. Seeing as he was a double agent, I guess you can't exactly cozy up to him right away, huh? Not in your wildest dreams. Still, I won't drag my feet around, so you've got nothing to worry about there. That works for me. Though if possible, I'd appreciate it if you'd stop glaring at me like that. But of course. Thanks. You guys can do whatever you want, just as long as we work together. On to the main topic. Melody, if you could go over the Covenant Holders for us. Right. These are the five people the Phantom Society had marked as Covenant Holders. First is Iron Mask, leader of the Covenant Recovery Project, or Project C. He's a Covenant Holder as well. The Covenant Recovery Project. How is the Phantom Society able to identify these individuals? A Covenant Holder can detect another simply by looking at them. A quick glance in their direction is all it takes. Coupling that with the organization's power, the Phantom Society has been able to identify Covenant Holders for a long time. Up next, we have Ichiro Onda, our late computer engineer. He held a Covenant, but had no summoning ability. Going off the security footage we just saw, his Covenant is currently being held by that man, Zenon. This means Iron Mask is in possession of at least two Covenants at this time. The third Covenant Holder is a Devil Summoner, Mangetsu Kuzunoha. I imagine a certain someone here knows a lot more about him than I do, though. He's one of Yadagarasu's top Devil Summoners, and one of the key players in protecting this country. There you have it. The fourth is a man named Saizo, who operates out of Karakacho. He's a freelance summoner who's had dealings with both Yatagarasu and the Phantom Society. And lastly, our fifth Covenant Holder was me. Though that's clearly not the case anymore. That's the one I currently have. So many of them have switched owners in such a short time. It's kind of hard to follow. Hang on a sec. Does that mean Iron Mask was targeting those two Covenant Holders at once? If that's true, then the others could be in danger too. Milady. Any idea where Saizo might be? Word is, he's typically hanging around Bar Hydran about this time. It's over on Jinsando Street. Then that's where we gotta go. You coming, Fig? I'll wait here for everyone. If worse comes to worst, we can't allow our enemies to obtain any more covenants. That said, you'll need an operator of sorts to appraise the situation. So allow me to play that role from the back end. Roger. We'll let you handle things here then. 